wherever you are in your life right now, whatever phase of your life, imagine where you want to go. There are five ways or five steps to get you there. And to share those five steps, I've got Jamie Close, aka the Vitality King. He's a spiritual, what do we call you? A spiritual... Spiritual energetic healer. Spiritual energetic healer. All right, so what are the five steps that this person watching us right now should take in order to achieve their goal and get on to the next step? Fantastic. So we want to look at ourselves holistically. So that's W-H-O-L, holistic. So we're looking physically, energetically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. So spiritually is not really a religious thing. It's just what you believe is that highest sort of aspect of ourself. So we want to take actions in all of those five areas to make sure that we've got a solid foundation to be able to ascend and grow and evolve ourselves in our life. So what we really want to do is want to look where we're at now and where we want to go. So it's around getting a very clear vision of what we wish to desire more in our lives and then programming the cells of our body to vibrate at that emotional frequency. That's the key. So if, if it's just setting a goal, like I want to earn a certain amount of money in the next three months from my business, right? Not just to make money, but like I want my business to excel um, to a point where I've set a 90-day goal. Do I, how do I energetically feel that awesome. so, so I make that happen? Sweet. So there's two aspects that just dropped into my awareness. One, it's about the people you're serving. So it's like, okay, so if you've got a target of earning another, say, 50K in the next 30 days, it's like, how many people do I need to serve? What's the difference I'll make in the lives and the impact to help them? Right. That's very important. Right. Secondly, it's not about the money. It's about helping the people. But when it comes to you personally and your business and the volume of money is what will that money be able to give you? What choices? What will your life look like having that extra income? And then the key is to visualize that but to energetically and emotionally feel it in your body now. And that link, that emotional and energetic link to that vision will bring it to you. Yeah. The kicker is to not be attached to the actual outcome. Because right. you, you might have, some, your higher self might be bringing something to you of a, a better nature, a higher nature, but if you stay attached to it, it's gotta be that car or it has to be that home, you may be blocking the thing that's really what you desire coming to you. Right. A lot of people make mistakes with vision boards, right? Like they put pictures of a nice house or a fancy car or a nice watch and they go, I'm going to focus on that. I'm going to work towards that. I'm going to achieve it. But what what might be better is imagery of you helping people because that's really what you want. It's not the fancy car. It's not the watch. It's the feeling that you get from achieving the car and achieving the watch and achieving a house, right? Absolutely. Okay. So... So the first thing is the five of the five steps is energetically feel where you're headed. Absolutely. Okay. What's the what's the step number two? Well, uh, well, step number one would was exactly what you said, but one, number one would be more about your physical body. Right. Making okay. sure you're grounded because if you're not energetically grounded, your energy is going to be up and in your head. Right. And you need to be in your body to be able to feel the emotion. Okay. So one physical body grounded, two energetically being aligned with your vision. Okay. You know, three, uh, mentally using your mind to visualize what it is that you desire. Four would be emotionally feeling, feeling that which you desire and letting go of the attachment to that physical thing. And five would be spiritually. Spiritually, it's more like the giving back. How would your life be different? How would those other lives be different for the people that you're impacting and helping to transform their lives? Okay, I like that. So it's not so much just setting a goal of this is the target I want to hit. I want to lose 20 pounds in 30 days. I want to lose 20 pounds in 30 days. It's energetically feeling it in your body, in your soul, in your mind, and how you will feel in that moment. So it's focusing on how you will feel when you achieve your goal as well, right? Okay, so what I'm picking up here is it's all about feeling, right? And energy. Yes. Okay, great. Anything else? Any other parting uh, words? That pretty much encompasses it. All right. I I think really it comes down to, well, not I think, I feel, it comes down to what's your highest excitement. If you're following your passions and your highest excitement, it doesn't matter that you don't know where you're going in another 30 days. It's what right now is going to take you in that direction of your vision. That's what's most important. Because when we're driving a car from LA to San Francisco, we can't see all the way. We can only see 15, 20 meters in front of us. Right. All right, great. So make sure you get that energy going. Like you feel the energy, you feel the goal, you feel the journey. Get into your body more um, and uh, 
it's going to be a lot easier to stay on track whatever goal that you're trying to achieve because you're going to be feeling it. All right, so thanks very much. Where do we find more about you, Jamie? Okay, you can go on to, uh, say, Facebook and look for the, the Vitality King or you can go to my website, jamieclose.com. All right, thanks, Jamie. Appreciate Excellent. it. Excellent, thank you.